This is the true story of a teenage boy who risks everything to become the youngest FBI informant in history. Wow, it's set in the 1980s Detroit during the height on the war on drugs. The film follows Rick Worsh Jr. as he gets sucked into a life of crime that puts his entire family in danger. Rick's dad is played by Matthew McConaughey. And earlier, Kathy and I sat down with the Oscar winner and his co-stars, Richie Merritt, Jonathan Majors, and Val Powley, to talk about their new movie, White Boy Rick. And the boys gonna go out later. You wanna come? Uh, I promise Grandma I'll make cookies with her. I know. I'm a loser. No, you were just lost for a little bit. This ain't the same thing at all. Thanks. Yeah, right there. Hang on, Pop. I'm not done with you. Back in here, I got a toast. Hey, hey. Right here, Don. A lot of work. Okay, come on in. Everybody wanna make a toast? Here's the family. Everybody drink up. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay, we know we got a problem already. Here's the cast the is here with us. Matthew McConaughey, Richie Merritt, Jonathan Majors, and Belle Powley. First of all, look at you all with this Oscar winner next. You guys don't seem at all intimidated. You don't seem... What's it like working with this guy? <laughs> you didn't even know who he was, right? What? I didn't even know who I was. It was fun. You know, every day was uh, a journey. You know, we always had fun on set. Did you not know him, honestly, when you started? No, I, no, I, I knew his name, but I didn't have, like, an image for him. You he didn't like, Google him? No. <laughs> we, met, we met for the first time in, a, in the parking lot of a bowling alley in yeah. East L.A. And I had seen a picture of him, so I knew what he looked like. And I'm waiting at the entrance. And here comes young Richie Merritt walking by. He would have passed right by me. Yeah. But I had to go, hey, Richie. And he's like, yeah. I said, McConaughey's like, oh, cool, man. <laughs> and you had never acted before, hon? No. Wow. Never had a job. Down a, a, the principal's job, office no. in Baltimore, Maryland, I hear. <laughs> right? Yeah. That's going to look good on your resume. <laughs> now, I guess the rest of y'all, the rest of you guys, the rest of you guys hadn't worked together either. Where'd you get your start? Oh, man. Um, right out of Yale School of Drama. Mm -hmm. I, got a, I got pulled out to do um, a miniseries on ABC with uh, Gus Van Zandt and uh, Dustin Lance Black. Look at uh, you. Two Yale years School ago. of Drama. Yeah, from the Baltimore Principles. That's how capricious our business yeah. is. Yeah. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And what about you, Bill? Um, I started in a children's TV show in the UK about child spies. Which was pretty fun. <laughs> and then a lot of theater. And then I did my first American movie, which is called The Diary of a Teenage Girl. I actually came on this show for yes, mm -hmm. like a few years ago. Yeah, you got a great cast, Matthew. Look how fatherly he is towards them all. Yeah. No, this is the, the, it was a wonderful. Every single day was uh, another great exercise coming to the set to work with everybody. You have people that have done this before. Yeah. You have someone who's never done it before, so it was a different experience with this young man, who we were just saying, look, if he can behave honestly on camera, which he could, and he did, and he puts together a great performance, and he's the full-on lead in this movie, you and, know? So and you say it's a true story, too. You ended up, your story. character ends up going to jail, right? Prison for yeah. 30 years, because it's a first count, you're out. Yeah, he was uh, locked up since 17. Yeah. He's yeah. been locked up for old. like 27 years. Same age as this man right now. Wow. Wow. Even though this he helped man. the FBI. Right. Mm -hmm. But then they said we cannot confirm nor deny that he was wow. an informant. Wow. But think about that. Same age as this young man right here. Boom. Life in prison. With three kids. With three, with three kids. Wow. You've done so many different films, Matthew, and you could probably have your pick of films you wanted to be in. What was it about White Boy Rick that made you say, this is, this is good for me? Well, one, that it was based in a true story. Yeah. When I read the script... Uh, I don't know what y'all thought, but I was like, oh, this is worth being made, even if it's fiction, mm -hmm. but it's not. Wow. Um, so that gave it more resonance and more purpose. Um, then secondly, for me, I'd never, I'd never played a dad like this. Uh -huh. um, uh, the story, the, the tragedy, but the humor in it, and somebody trying to hold their family together very unsuccessfully, but trying to. And at mm -hmm. the root of it, that's what our whole story is about, family. Mm -hmm. um, I'm trying to hold our family together. My son, my daughter, he's got his own family. He's trying to hold together on the mm -hmm. streets. He goes to him and finds a father figure mm -hmm. that's that's much more of an alpha male than the father he has at home, which mm -hmm. I'm playing. But it so leads it him into the drug family. world, too. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It happens. Yeah. Yeah. Speaking of yeah. family. We love your family, Matthew. We no, love your bride. You. We're really happy Camilla, Camilla did not come Camilla, over here today to we say, were to cook for us, actually. They've all been asking for you, sweetie. <laughs> I know. That's how we do. How's everything going at home? Everything's going well. Yeah. We actually took our first proper vacation. Um, we went to Greece and Italy and the South of family? France. Mama wanted family. to go, but Camilla convinced <laughs> no, her to no, stay. We took, we, took my, we took my mother, yeah. and we took, we took her, her father came and met us. So we had everybody for three weeks over in Greece. It was good. Look at you. Look at your life, man. 
You guys have a good one. It's you guys, all good. Congrats on the movie. Thank yeah. Well, thank we you wish you the best of luck. White Boy Rick is in theaters today. Yes. <laughs>